10 Natural Ways to Boost Fertility Fast and Easy In this short video, I will show you the 10 natural ways how to boost fertility fast and easy. Welcome to Healthy Life Tips, here we educate and entertain our viewers and give out free gifts every single month, if you are not subscribed yet, make sure to hit the big red button below to subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you could be the first to get our new video, also click the link on the description for our monthly free gift. Fertility issues affect up to 15% of couples. The road to parenthood can sometimes be a huge challenge but know you're not alone in those challenges. Luckily, there are a few natural ways to increase your fertility. In fact, food choices and lifestyle changes can help boost fertility. Here are 16 natural ways to boost fertility and get pregnant faster. 1. Eat foods rich in antioxidants. Antioxidants like folate and zinc may improve fertility for both men and women. They deactivate the free radicals in your body, which can damage both sperm and egg cells. In 2012 study of young, adult men found that eating 75 grams of antioxidant-rich walnuts per day improved sperm quality. A study of 232 women showed that higher folate intake was associated with higher rates of implantation, clinical pregnancy, and live birth. The jury is still out on how much antioxidants will or won't affect fertility, but there's evidence pointing to the potential. Foods such as fruits, vegetables, nuts, and grains are packed full of beneficial antioxidants like vitamins C and E, folate, beta-carotene, and lutein. Eating more of these healthy foods shouldn't hurt in the effort. 2. Eat a bigger breakfast. Eating a substantial breakfast may help women with fertility problems. One study found that eating a larger breakfast may improve the hormonal effects of polycystic ovary syndrome PCOS, a major cause of infertility. For moderate weight women with PCOS, eating most of their calories at breakfast reduced insulin levels by 8% and testosterone levels by 50%. High levels of either can contribute to infertility. In addition, by the end of the 12-week study, these women had ovulated more than women who ate a smaller breakfast and larger dinner, suggesting improved fertility. However, it's important to note that increasing the size of your breakfast without reducing the size of your evening meal is likely to lead to weight gain. 3. Avoid trans fats. Eating healthy fats every day is important for boosting fertility and overall health. However, trans fats are associated with an increased risk of ovulatory infertility, due to their negative effects on insulin sensitivity. Trans fats are commonly found in hydrogenated vegetable oils and are usually present in some margarine, fried foods, processed products, and baked goods. Some of the faves, we know. 4. Cut down on carbs if you have PCOS. Following a lower carb eating plan, where less than 45% of calories come from carbs, is generally recommended for women with PCOS. Several studies have indicated that managing carb intake provides beneficial effects on some aspects of PCOS. Lower carb diets may help you maintain a healthy weight, reduce insulin levels, and encourage fat loss, all while helping menstrual regularity. Studies have found that a diet higher in trans fats and lower in unsaturated fats was linked to infertility for both men and women. 5. Eat fewer refined carbs. Speaking of carbs, it's not just the amount of carbs that are important, but also the type. Refined carbs may be especially problematic. Refined carbs include sugary foods and drinks and processed grains, including white pasta, bread, and rice. These carbs are absorbed very quickly, causing spikes in blood sugar and insulin levels. Refined carbs also have a high glycemic. The GI tells you if carbohydrate-dense food will raise your blood sugar significantly. Insulin is chemically similar to ovarian hormones. These hormones help our eggs mature. Consistently elevated insulin can cause the body to produce fewer reproductive hormones because it thinks it doesn't need it. 
This can contribute to a lack of egg maturation and ovulation. Given that PCOS is associated with high insulin levels, refined carbs can make it even worse. 6. Eat more fiber. Fiber helps your body get rid of excess hormones and keeps blood sugar balanced. Certain types of fiber can help remove excess estrogen by binding to it in the intestines. The excess estrogen is then removed from the body as a waste product. One older 2009 study soluble fiber, such as from avocados, sweet potatoes, oats, and fruits, with lower levels of estrogen and progesterone. Soluble fiber from fruit especially had the strongest association with lower concentrations of estrogen. Some examples of high fiber foods are whole grains, fruits, vegetables, and beans. The daily recommended intake of fiber for women is 25 grams per day and 31 grams for men. In 2009 study found that eating 10 grams more cereal fiber per day was associated with a 44% lower risk of ovulatory infertility among women older than 32 years. 7. Swap protein sources. Replacing some animal proteins such as meat, fish, and eggs with vegetable protein sources such as beans, nuts, and seeds is linked to a reduced risk of infertility. A study showed that when 5% of total calories came from vegetable protein instead of animal protein, the risk of ovulatory infertility decreased by more than 50%. 2018 study concluded that eating more fish correlates to a higher probability of live birth following infertility treatment. Consider replacing some of the proteins in your diet with protein from vegetables, beans, lentils, nuts, and low mercury fish. Try this coconut chickpea curry for a protein-filled dinner. 8. Choose high-fat dairy. High intakes of low-fat dairy foods may increase the risk of infertility, whereas high-fat dairy foods may decrease it. One large study from 2007 looked at the effects of eating high-fat dairy more than once a day or less than once a week. It found that women who consumed one or more servings of high-fat dairy per day were 27% less likely to be infertile. To reap these potential benefits, try replacing one low-fat dairy serving per day with one high-fat dairy serving, such as a glass of whole milk or full-fat yogurt. This buffalo chicken dip made with full-fat Greek yogurt is divine. 9. Add in a multivitamin. If you take multivitamins, you may be less likely to experience ovulatory infertility. In fact, an estimated 20 ovulatory infertility may be avoided if women consume three or more multivitamins per week. Micronutrients found in vitamins have essential roles in infertility. For women trying to get pregnant, a multivitamin containing folate may be especially beneficial. Have a chat with your doctor about supplements including any multivitamins that could help get you closer to pregnancy. 10. Get active. Exercise has many benefits for your health, including increased fertility. Increasing moderate physical activity has a positive on fertility for women and men, especially those with obesity. Exercise has many benefits for your health, including increased fertility. Increasing moderate physical activity has a positive on fertility for women and men, especially those with obesity. The trick is that moderation is key. Excessive high-intensity exercise has actually been with decreased fertility in certain women. Excessive exercise may change the energy balance in the body and negatively affect your reproductive system. If you plan to increase your activity, add it gradually and make sure your healthcare team is aware. See if your doctor is in favor of you adding these yoga poses to your routine. Thanks for watching. Click the first link on the description to get this amazing fertility vitamin with a discount for a limited time. Also share this video if you find some value in it.